My dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, a very good morning and welcome to this morning blessing prayer and divine mercy novena. The word of God is from the book of the Acts of the Apostles, chapter 3, word 15. And you kill the order of life, whom God raised from the dead. To this we are witnesses. My dear brothers and sisters, these days we are focusing our attention on the great event of resurrection. We proclaim Jesus is resurrected from the dead. But my brothers and sisters, the resurrection of Jesus is the work of the Heavenly Father. Father loved the world so much he sent his only son to this world and we the sinners crucified him but heavenly father continued his love for us he has given new life to jesus through the great mystery of resurrection let us remember the wonderful blessings that we received from the Heavenly Father through Jesus Christ and Holy Spirit. Amen. Now we pray the Divine Mercy Novena in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today Jesus tells, bring to me the souls who especially venerate and glorify my mercy and immerse them in my mercy. These souls sorrowed most over my passion and entered most deeply into my spirit. They are living images of my compassionate heart. These souls will shine with a special brightness in the next life. Not one of them will go into the fire of hell. I shall particularly defend each one of them at the hour of death. Most merciful Jesus, whose heart is love itself, receive into the abode of your most compassionate heart the souls of those who particularly extol and venerate the greatness of your mercy. These souls are mighty with the very power of God himself. In the midst of all affliction and adversities, they go forward confident of your mercy and united to you. O oh, Jesus, they carry all mankind on their shoulders. These souls will not be judged severely, but your mercy will embrace them as they depart from this life. Eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon the souls who glorify and glorify and venerate your greatest attribute, that of your fathomless mercy, and who are enclosed in the most compassionate heart of Jesus. These souls are a living gospel. Their hands are full of deeds of mercy, and their heart overflowing with joy, sing a canticle of mercy to you. O Most High, I beg you, O God, show them your mercy according to the hope and trust they have placed in you. Let there be accomplished in them the promise of Jesus, who said to them that during their life, but especially at the hour of death, the souls who will venerate this fathomless mercy of his, he himself will defend as his glory. Amen. My brothers and sisters, I request each one of you, please do share this Novena prayer with your friends and relatives and people whom you know. Let's all pray this great Novena of Divine Mercy and receive the blessing of the Lord. Please do pray the Divine Mercy chaplet along with this Novena prayer. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.